Hey Libra, welcome back to my channel, The Blessed Week Tarot and Guidance. So, I am going to do your reading for the year 2023. So, it will be a kind of highlights of 2023 for you. I will bring more, more readings in this channel. So, please subscribe and uh, press the bell notification icon. Okay. Well, if you have your sun, moon or rising in the Libra, you can refer to this reading. Okay. Here we go. Let's get started. Okay, Eight of Pentacles. A lot of hard work. Daughter of Wands. Career, career. Two of Cups. Whoa. Ace of Pentacles. Okay. 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 Now let me clarify this cards. Ace of Pentacles. Why? Why Ace of Pentacles? Ace of Cups. Wow. New beginning. Two of Cups. Achha, five of Cups. Past love. Okay. Daughter of Wands. Three of Pentacles. Okay. Three of Pentacles. Reward recognition, structure and goals achieved. Three of Wands. Oh, sorry. Three of Swords. Chariot. Fantastic. Okay. So Libra, your first card came Eight of Pentacles. That means definitely you have to put a lot of effort in the year 2023. Okay. The, you know, theme of the uh, year 2023 for you is hard work. Upgrading your skills. Upgrading your personality. Upgrading your qualities. And uh, be dedicated and committed towards your goals. These are the theme for you in the 2023. Okay. So, I am saying some good news will be received. Some communication will be received. And uh, it's most probably related to your career. Okay. If you have been working for something, you have appeared some job interviews or you give, you have given some interview, uh, some examination, you appeared some examination, then some good communication, you will get the job, you know, job related communication you will receive. Again, with the two of cups, I'm seeing that in your love life, you will receive some proposal from someone who let you down in the past. Because this, yeah, we, this is five of pentacles card and see here are two roses and here one roses and the petal, one petal is falling down like this, this rose is uh, missing the other rose. Okay. So you were, you were feeling lonely without someone and that person most probably will give you a love proposal in the year of 2023 okay for some if you are feeling lonely and nobody even there in your life you know you have been single then your soulmate may enter in your life and it will be a new person because you have been single and if you have been separated someone let you down someone leave you in cold so, I mean, someone left you, you in cold, then chances are there you are going to receive a love proposal from that person. And you will have a solid new beginning with that person 
which will give you stability in future along with uh, along with a lot of wealth might be uh, that person is now financially stable uh, financially stable and he or she can provide you the wealth you you deserve the lifestyle you deserve and uh, yeah this this union or reunion is going to give you stability and this ace of pentacles just below this ace of cups came so you are going to have a new beginning in your love life and along with a stability along with financial stability okay it will last longer you can expect there will be no separation like before and even if it's a new connection completely brand new connection then you can see long term uh, relationship with this person okay with this connection so again this three a daughter of wands is clarified with three of pentacles definitely some some reward recognition promotion is coming in our way some appreciation later you may receive some promotion later you may receive or some uh, you know good marks if uh, result will be out you will score very good marks and people will recognize your skill and talent this good news is related to your financial and uh, career aspect and this uh eight of pentacles is clarified with three of swords so it says in past you might be heartbroken because here we saw somebody let you down and because of this heart broken heart you turned out to be a very hard working person you put efforts on yourself you build your uh, own empire your own world and you will be overcome this energy even if past you have been uh, through this energy but in 2023 you are completely shifting your focus from your love life to your personal and financial growth towards your career growth so this heartbreak was a kind of blessing in disguise for you and you you utilized this uh, heartbroken energy in such a beautiful way you built your own empire you worked hard on yourself you upgraded your personality if not you are going to do so you you are going to work on your career and finance go uh, more seriously and after this this beautiful things this relationship is going to be mended okay so bottom of the deck we got chariot this is a major arcana major change and uh, and strange thing is just below that this ace of wands came again uh, as card means a new beginning so which a chariot card a lot of travel will be there okay and uh, also chariot talks about uh, union or reunion with a soulmate so that's obviously going to happen and career related travel you can expect if you have been stuck in some area of your life you will see that things are running fast okay and um, you will feel energetic towards your goals if you have been feeling low little bit now you you will feel you will have that horse like power within you okay you energetically chase your goals here you can see there is a sun there is a moon it talks about if the couples were in uh, separation they are going to reunite or you are going to meet your divine counterpart that what we saw in this two of cups card also pentacles career related financial related travel will be there and it will be beneficial for you if any relocation opportunity or shifting opportunity you are getting reloc relocation to other city relocating uh, your 
हाउस और रिलोकेटिंग फॉर जॉब मस्ट ग्रैप दैट अपॉर्चुनिटी ट्रैवल इज गोइंग टू बी बेनिफिशियल फॉर यू ओके ओके नाउ लेट मी चेक व्हाट विल बी द ब्लॉकेजेस हियर डिफाइन प्लेस कार्ड मी व्हाट आर द ब्लॉकेजेस फॉर लिखा व्हाट आर द ब्लॉकेजेस फॉर लिखा नाइट ऑफ पेंटेकल्स ओके नाइट ऑफ पेंटेकल्स के मार्ज ब्लॉकेजेस ओके लेट मी सी मोर पेज ऑफ वॉन्स किंग ऑफ कप्स ऑल द एलिमेंट्स के पेंटेकल्स वॉन्स एंड कप्स ओके Eight of Swords. Okay. First thing is, don't think about the outcome and become fearful. Just take the next required action. Okay. Don't be stuck anymore. And your emotions might create blockages for you. So be emotionally mature. You know where to apply your emotions and where to apply your logical mind. and work at getting key page of wands card says that you have to maintain a child like three always hold the maturity but ignite that passion within you okay and uh, you need to be disciplined sometimes you you will fail to be disciplined because things are running very fast you are going to experience a high paced life very busy life might might be sometimes you will fail to uh, follow any routine or schedule but make sure if one day you are failing the next day you must follow that once again come back to the truck and be disciplined okay don't be over emotional don't be less emotional always maintain the emotional maturity and don't be stuck in your mind don't overthink if you are puzzled within your mind just take a pen and paper and write down all the thoughts what is running in your mind so that your mind will be empty and you will come to know what what is running behind your subconscious okay and it will make you to take action it will give you a uh, a mental clarity but don't be stuck this is stutter of wands and this is page of wands definitely a message a message a good news you will receive and that is more significant for you both the same cards daughter of wands and page of wands that is very uh, that good news is going to be very very significant for you in the in the um year of 2023 okay this uh this messes will pay, play a key role for you in 2023 so here after receiving this messes you have to show this emotional maturity Okay, now let's check. What do you need to do in twenty twenty three? Divine, please guide me, Libra. What do you need to do in twenty twenty three? What do you need to do in twenty twenty three? Eight of Cups. Okay. Seven of Swords, yeah. Eight of Swords so again. Here Eight of Swords and here Eight of Swords. Something is there which is holding you back. Something is there which is making you scared. Okay, Five of Cups. so the thing is 
all the cards talks about that somebody let you down in past somebody let you down somebody in fact betrayed you somebody didn't you know somebody left you in cold didn't care about you but the good thing is what do you need to do you need to move away from that particular situation you need to change your direction that is what you need to do in 2023 change your direction towards your highest good because this energy is not going to do any good with you okay and be a matured emotional matured person going forward to identify that face behind the mask that betrayal face behind the mask try to just try to identify all that glitters is not gold so similar way you need to be more emotional matured to identify people what is their hidden agenda what is their hidden hidden uh, you know intentions and you are you got such experiences in your life so that you were scared to trust any people once again but that should not be the case be brave enough let's say if we are walking on a road and we met an accident then we must not stop walking we can change the road but we must not stop walking similar way if somebody betrayed you you must not stop believing all the people still good people exist in the world and you need to remove this mask this blindfolded this blindfold to identify the people okay so i must say just think about what is best for you just go for that past things you have to leave behind when you engage in your you know day to day activities automatically these things will be kept behind you don't have to put any uh, you know effort extra effort just put effort to move towards your best thing and don't be stuck don't be fearful and uh, yeah five of cups stop repenting and regretting the past make peace with the past let it be as it is just you move forward towards your best thing okay now let's take some guidances from the universe what universe has to tell you guide you libra universe please give me some guidances for libra you are good enough yeah something yeah, i can feel that your confidence is little bit scattered because of this wet betrayal because you met some wrong people in your life our experiences make us okay not any people not any situation what you learned from that situation just remember that and and forget everything just forget and forget forget just remember what you learned and rest you forget and forget emotions are run, running high definitely you need to maintain balance between your emotional emotionality and practicality i am seeing that emotional maturity is very much needed for you libra in the year 2023 you are carrying forward past energy try to leave that energy in this december only don't don't take uh, it forward with you in 2023 go for a fresh start the energy is gaining momentum yes this says that you will gradually feel energetic and uh, passionate for your goals for your own betterment so just erase the past 
from your mind from everywhere what else guidance for libra adjustments are required okay you need to be little flexible that's what the universe is trying to tell you okay you need to be flexible with your attitude don't be so stubborn with anything like uh, don't don't make a pattern don't make a strict pattern like i will follow this pattern only break the pattern this different situation different demands different you so be that different you every time you know be flexible in such a way that you can be fit in any shape okay that is what uh, flexibility called okay and have confidence in you always and be emotionally mature gradually universe is blessing you with more energy your life will move forward be like this free bird don't be caged in the past so libra this is all i have for you uh, for 2023 and uh, will bring me more readings and so stay tuned to my channel uh, like share and subscribe and i hope you like the reading bye bye bless me